Oh, hey everybody, welcome back. Johnny Silver here. It's been a while since I've been able to uh, put out a video. I have been busy, uh, unbelievably, with work and also getting, uh, well, I built a new uh, stage, so to speak, for how I was filming. And I've got it about, oh, maybe 90% complete, 95% complete, something like that. I've been working, uh, trying to do, well, really be able to change up how I'm doing shots. So this is my first uh, time shooting on the new rig, trying to make, uh, see how it goes anyway. Can't wait to uh, see how this turns out myself anyways. It's been a while. So I'm doing this like a kind of an update in a half ass 100 subscriber special. Thank you to everybody for subscribing. I'll give you a little bit of an idea of what's coming on here. You see, I got these little graphite uh, ingots. They're very small. Uh, this is a two cavity. No idea how much that uh, holds. So I got that. And Here's one that's got three cavities. Take a look at this quick. Oh my gosh, it's like wrapped like Christmas present. Oh, there you go. So that's super tiny there. It's about, uh, yeah. So that one's about this width of my pinky. So I'm uh, 6'2". That'll give you an idea about how big my pinky is. Other stuff I opened up. I've actually had the crucibles and stuff like this for a long time. But man, finding the time and the ability to get out and get any damn thing done just isn't it. I have been swamped with, uh, well, computer repairs. That, that got to me last time and it got to me this time too. And then, you know, the uh, place I work is an old school kind of place here where... Uh, when we're very busy, we're very busy. And if you call in sick, well, if you got time to be sick, you apparently don't have the time to work. Most people don't survive being sick even their first time there. So, you know, it is what it is. If you do your job well, getting sick isn't really a huge deal, but it can be a real bastard, though. So, but, you know, it's... it's uh. I know some guys are, are in the trade, some uh, iron workers whose uh, job is the exact same way. I'm not an iron worker and I'm not in the trades, but my boss is a uh, little of, uh, I don't know what you want to call him. I don't know what necessarily I want to call him anything, just in case he comes across this show. <laughs> you know, I'm not making uh, a huge amount of money on this at all. I'm not really making any at all, it's just for fun. Oh, how the hell did they even get that thing in there? All right, there we go. So that's uh, vaguely disappointing. Two ounce ingot molds. So that should hold two ounces of metal. And what's this one? It's an unknown. Oh, they marked the other ones. Oh, the wrapper. Okay. All right. So anyway, you know, you, you got a lot of overtime coming on and, you know, it's, uh, I definitely like to pick up overtime here and there. It, uh, it all helps, but man, it's just been a lot. And then, so, you know, I did like, uh, <sighs> talking about expensive here, I had brakes. I did the up pipes on, uh, I've got an old Forge, uh, Ford, an old Ford uh, dually uh, pickup truck with a 7.3 in it. 
and uh, the up pipes in the rear coming off the turbo there uh, the gaskets had rotted out and it was uh, burning through the pipe so I had to replace that too anyways long said done it cost uh, about forty two hundred dollars then to do it oh yeah these ones computer repair cost me at the time about three hundred dollars four hundred dollars I think those would be pretty cool, the little button ones. So these are one ounce, one ounce square or so. That should be a lot of fun. I can't wait to get on to pouring those. I've got crucibles somewhere. They came in the mail. Some of them are damaged. Um, you know, it is what it is. But I don't know where they're at, though. I'm also in the... So here's the other thing I got going on, too. Um, they're kind of preparing for a multi-state move. So I'm going to be moving, and we're looking to move. I'm looking to move. This is still kind of in the the works at the moment, but uh, looking to move. I think from my house, it's got to be right around close to five-ish hundred miles, maybe. I really don't know. Here, let me give you my address, and you guys just throw it in, and then tell me down below. <laughs> but uh, yeah so i got all these ingots we're preparing for a uh, a, a big move anyway and uh yeah so it's just a lot of shit going on and it's like man when i do have time what i don't have time for is to play with this channel and do anything really i've uh i've been still you know setting back a little bit here and there I found a few neat little pieces at a, a local uh, coin, or not a coin shop, but a flea market. This is a, uh, a cool little uh, Mexican piece. I actually like it quite a bit. Reminds me of a piece I had when I was a kid. Uh, I actually bought this real quick. I thought it was silver. I didn't pay much attention to it. It's not. It's from the mid-80s, but it's cool anyway ish i'll probably throw it out somewhere trade it not really anything if it's not a uh, silver or a gold or something like that it'd have to be really cool for me to keep it and this is while well, cool isn't really what i was looking for so i got a little bit of a an unboxing here i don't have my address off it yet so i can't show you the front of the envelope but that's that and then got a cool one coming up from uh, monument metals and a really cool one here from uh, see how big this thing is Jeez Louise Scottsdale Mint <laughs> so let's see here I'm going to do a quick uh, changeover because yeah, I mean you, I mean you guys see this position all the time so I'll go ahead and do a quick changeover and show you another position which I'll be able to shoot from uh, using this rig now so i will be right back all right so here we are this gives me a little bit more depth of which i can uh, play with and do some different things you know it is what it is but i like to be able to bring just a little bit more uh depth to the show so to speak let's see where did i put my coins i got them around here here Kind of hard to see here. But. So yeah, I'm just giving you a real rough overview of what I got going on here. These are the... Uh... See, I'm just giving you a real rough overview of what's going on here. I'm trying to uh, figure it out, learn it, get some different things done here, and uh, just make it look good. So I'll be coming back. I've got uh, a couple other shots that I've been working on. Um, in fact, part of the reason is since I've had limited time of being able to do really cut videos, I've been working on a really special, uh, well, special to me anyways, uh, shot to do a coin on, or to do several coins on anyway. And that has eaten up a lot of my time. So when I should have been probably making a video, I've been trying to figure out other stuff, but my free time has been really crap anyway. So... Um, 
I apologize to y'all. I, I hate that uh, my first hundred people uh, that you got such a lame kind of, hey, I'm glad y'all uh, for some reason subscribe to my channel uh, expecting exciting frequent content and it just hasn't been but I, I feel bad about it I really do I just can't do a whole lot about it unfortunately I gotta work on lighting too that's got to be the next big thing to catch but I do like this so far it's just a matter of figuring it out the rest of the way. Like I said, I'm probably about 90, 95% done with my setup here. I'm pretty happy with how it is so far. The autofocus is probably, there we go, going to be kind of a problem. But it is what it is. I saw this at a flea market. I'm like, well, I'll have to do some kind of something on it. It's an old uh, Jim Beam bottle from... Uh, the 70s, 1970, for the state of Indiana. Indiana, that's Indianapolis, right? It's kind of interesting, though, that they have this in Indianapolis. Uh, uh, Fort Wayne has got a lot of interesting, weird shit, too, but that's Indiana for you. The only thing I like about Indiana is my uh, grandmother came from uh, West Lafayette, which is on the southwest corner of the state, I think. So, anyways, that's pretty much it. I know, just random fact off on the side, but uh, it is what it is. I'm still collecting, still doing some different things. So there'll be other videos coming out soon. I just can't guarantee you, hey, I'm going to be able to do, you know, three, four videos a week or something like that. I just don't necessarily have the time for that coming up. Um, my goal, though, is to get to the point where I do have that coming out. It's just a production issue. I've not been very happy. In fact, I, I will tell you straight out. I've not been happy with... Um, the shots I've been able to get on the coins to a great deal. Only a couple have come out like I wanted them to, so I had to change up how I was recording anyway. Um, so that was... Nope, didn't catch it. I can't quite see what I'm doing, but that's okay. Um, anyway, yeah, so I, I don't have a real good schedule coming out just yet or anything like that. It's just a matter of uh, trying to get ahead. And the uh, building a, a, a new way to for me to do this... Um, is really important i do have some other cool videos coming out soon huh. um that being said they should actually be out a lot sooner than i necessarily think or but i'm not necessarily willing to promise because uh i'm so close to done, being done with this set and being able to move on and really get it done right i've just got a few more things i got to do and uh, it should be good to go so you know there we go um yeah, I'm sorry this is this video is kind of all over the place. It is what it is. I'm just kind of getting back into it. I, I know, for the third time or whatever. But I just grin and bear with me. I, I'm, I'm not, I, I probably won't ever be a really super, uh, super regular channel. But maybe that'll change. I don't know. Right now, I just got to deal with work and moving and finishing out this build. And it's just like, oh, my God, the list of stuff I got to do is so bad. So I got shit to do. I know you guys got shit to do. So I tell you what. Why don't we get together next time and you can enjoy my video. Leave me a, a like, a thumbs up, if you will. Share me on the social medias. And, uh, yeah, just spread the word. So thank you, guys. We'll see you later. Bye-bye.